Hi, I'm Alison and this is the story of my recovery so far. About a year ago, I wasn't able to leave the house on my own unless I was taking my dogs for a walk and even at that, I was trying to avoid people at all costs. I'd drive to three or four different locations before each walk just to make sure that I wouldn't bump into anyone, especially somebody that I knew. Even walking out of my back door was a challenge because I was scared that I might bump into one of my neighbours. Not that I didn't, there was anything that I didn't want to see about my neighbours, just I didn't want to engage with the rest of the world. I just wanted to hide away. Um, so I was seeing my CPN regularly and she suggested she could put me in touch with a charity called Lanarkshire Association for Mental Health and I had never heard of them before but she said that for people in my situation who have lost all of their confidence um, and just weren't wanting to leave their homes they could help you to get back on your feet so it felt like a real lifeline that was being offered to me so given that I wasn't really living my life at the time I felt I had to grab that lifeline. So I did. I am um, the idea of a stranger coming to my house terrified me. Um but Joe came and we had a chat about what I was looking for and I really shouldn't have worried at all because Joe's just so lovely. Um so um we discussed how LEMH might be able to help me and I spoke about how I used to really enjoy going to the gym and doing some fitness work and that I know that physical activity makes me feel so much better in terms of my mental health as well as feeling physically better. And I'd put on a lot of weight as a result of the different medications that I'd been on over the, the prior kind of six months leading up to this. So I was feeling pretty terrible about myself. Um, so Jo suggested that one of her colleagues, Karen, would be the best person for me to be um, introduced to and who would hopefully be able to help me. So I met Karen and again I was put at my ease straight away and we started to go to the gym together. Just the two of us, we would go in and at first I was quite apprehensive about it, the idea of going back into that environment again and there being so many people around. But Karen was there supporting me every step of the way and I knew that she was really there for me, which felt so amazing. I, I just felt so um, cared for. So eventually, once I'd been going to the gym for a wee while, Karen introduced me to her Thursday afternoon gym group. And I've really not looked back since then because they're such a lovely bunch of ladies. We're all completely different. We all have different fitness goals. We all often do our own things or sometimes we do a circuit together when we're in at the gym. But we all get on really well and I have to say they're a fantastic bunch of people. So I've now started to go to a lot of the gym classes on my own um, and... I last year ran a couple of um, just mini triathlons and I started open water swimming and there's just no way that I would have been able to have done achieved any of that if it hadn't been for the support that I'd had from LEMH. Um, I continue to get support. I meet Karen every week and it's a good opportunity for her to sort of gauge how I'm doing I guess. I'm going through psychology at the moment and it's very challenging um, but it's also really making a difference to me I think and I know that it's the only way I'm going to get better is to pursue that that route but Karen's there to support me every step of the way just knowing that there's somebody there that really helps. Karen's also arranged for me to have regular calls from the crisis team because after my therapy sessions I tend to feel pretty um, just pretty wiped out and I, I don't feel great just really emotional so 
she's um, arranged for somebody to call me because I'm not the best at reaching out for help when I need it. Um, and the crisis line are fantastic. They just seem to know the right things to say and um, it's very comforting just to know that they're there and that there's people looking out for you. Like at every step of my journey, I feel like I'm supported. Um, I just, I don't know where I would be without LAMH. So yeah, I, I know that I still have a good way to go in terms of my recovery journey, but I feel confident that I can get there now because I've got the right support in place.